This is top, top stuff. That's probably yellowtail up there, rockfish. The stuff down below, like this deal there, that's the other ones. That's what we're looking for right there. That's a good bunch right there. Yeah, but he's got ten times the sea legs we do. Yeah. <laughs> you just let it scream to the bottom. Okay. And I'm not a big jigger. Okay. I like to keep reeling. Because when you're in that, that much water and you're jigging like this, uh -huh. you're moving that jig. You know, I mean there's the way it's slack. Moving. Right. So that you're on the you, you get to the bottom like you don't want to be there very long because you get caught up, but if that happens, don't worry about it. Okay. We just came off the you know, so it's quite a bit long. There's the bottom. Okay. So, I like to just work it around. Just reel it, stop it, reel it, stop it. Up to what point? Oh, you know, do that about three or four times and then just let her back down That's to the bottom. Okay. After a while, your line will get laid out because of the tie. Sure. Then you'll want to you'll want to reel it back in again okay. and start over. You got a fish there, Aaron? I certainly do. All right. How's it feel? Feels all right. Feels like a fish, right? Doesn't feel like anything too big. Sea bass. All right. That's yes. two two fish in a, two minutes and two different species. Very nice. Yeah. And he goes. Okay. Gotta be sure to bleed the fish. Nice. There you go. Hooked into our first nice size ling cod. You can tell it's a ling by the there's a lot of weight. It took a couple nice runs. Really bulldogging it. You can see that rod just doubled over there. That's what you come out to Nia Bay for. It's a nice little fish, probably about uh, what, 26, 27? Yeah. Inches. Keeper. Inches, yeah. <laughs> Big bad fish. You gotta watch out for the gill plates, they're a little sharp. Teeth in that dude. And you can you can kind of work him a little bit if you can. 
so it's Aaron's turn. He's got a nice, nice lane going. Look at that rod bend. The line's stripping out. Brace, brace yourself. No, you want to sit out of that cooler? Yeah. Let me. There you go. I just don't want to go over. I don't either. I don't want you to go over. Alright. I don't want you to go over. I don't know. I think it'd be kind of an interesting shot. I don't know if it would. <laughs> <laughs> I'll get it on film. We'll have it as a blooper <laughs> at the end. Ah, uh, you got him turned, Aaron. You got him turned. You got him coming. Oh, well, oh. you had him turned. This is a big fish. It's a light pole. Oh, he oh. just come loose. Oh, oh. no. He's gone. Oh. <laughs> There's the. Dejected angler right to, right there. Yeah. Another big ling on the line here. Oh. Yeah, he's not out. Yeah, they are good fish. I think if they grew as big as sharks, uh, they'd be uh, more feared than the sharks. They wouldn't be. This is a good fish. Wow, wait. And we suddenly started running into them. Yeah, they just uh, just come on, you know, and they get over a little pocket of You're gaining. You're gaining. Yeah, he's tiring. It's a good thing, because I am too. There he is. Oh, nice, nice fish. Can you get him in the water now? Big water. leg. Oh, man, that is... <laughs> That's a nice one. That's a good fish. Oh, Mike. Oh. That's a nice one, Mike. Oh. Well done. Yeah! <laughs> That's what we're looking for. Right there, nice near bay leg. That is amazing you caught that fish. Look at where you have it hooked. The jig has 15 pound monofilament. It's amazing you ever seen that fish. Wow, that it didn't cut it right off. Yeah, the teeth. Yeah. Yeah. Wow, that's something. What can I say? I got skills. I got skills. <laughs> and a little bit of luck. There it's broken. I don't know if I want to see it. Okay. So there you go. Book a trip on XL Charters and you can be into fish like this too. Seaweet.